Hello guys, in this video tutorial we will tell you how you can show ads in your app. Go to your app's overview page and under engage users click on advertisement. You'll be redirected to the advertisement section. Now click in-house ads in the side menu. Here you will see the campaigns and report sections. First let's go to the campaign section and add a new promotional campaign. Click the add type button here and select an app type for your ad campaign from the options including banner, intercidio, and overlay. If you want to display full screen ads that cover the interface of your app then you can select intercidio ads or you can select banners ads type that appear as a small strip or banner at the bottom of the screen. You can also select overlay ads that are banner like ads but slightly bigger. For now let's select the intercidio ad type and create a new campaign. Click on the Add New Campaign button here and provide the necessary information. Enter a name for your campaign. Select Android, iOS, or both platforms where you want your ad campaign to be served. Similarly, set the location where you want to serve ads. You can either select all countries or select countries of your preferred choice from the dropdown. Next, set the ad campaign limit by the number of impressions or by date. The campaign ads will remain active according to the limit you set here. If you set the limit by date, you need to set the start and end date and the time zone. Now let's add an image for your ad campaign that will be displayed on the app. Click upload file in the simulation screen to upload an image and add an image. Once uploaded, you can check how the image will appear on the app in the simulation screen. Next, enter the ad title, ad description, and select the destination URL link. You can select an internal link to direct your app user to a future within the app when they click on the ad, or if you want to redirect your users to an external link, then you can select the external link and provide the URL in the destination URL field. Once you have provided the required details, click on save and you'll be redirected to the campaign section. Here you can view your created campaign and its detail including campaign name, platform and status. You can manage settings, make the campaign active, inactive or delete the campaign. Under settings you can manage ads and also edit the campaign details. Now click manage ads and you'll be redirected to the manage ads section. Here you will see all your ads for the specific campaign. Click View crea cre Creative to see how the ad will appear on the app. You can also view other ad details including ad ID, ad title, ad size, and type, ad description, destination URL, and the status active or pause. Under the Action column, click on the Edit icon to update the ad details. From here you can change the title, description, image, and destination URL. Once done, click Update. If you want to pause the ad, click on the Play Pause button here or click the bin icon to delete the ad. You can also create a new ad for your campaign. Select the ad type, click Create New Ad and provide the required details to create a new ad. Now let's go back to the campaign section. Click the Edit Campaign button to update your campaign details. Enter the required details and then click Update. If you want, you can pause and delete the campaign from the auction column. You can also add a new campaign by clicking the add new campaign button here. Now let's go to the report section. Click report in the side menu to view your ad campaign report. Here you can check the campaign name, platform, campaign status, number of impressions, and the number of clicks made by the users on the ad. If you want, you can also filter and export the ad report. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates as soon as they are live.